Hello everyone and welcome back to my first iRacing video in quite a while. Thanks everyone for joining. As you can see, we are doing some dirt track racing today at Vanier Speedway, National Speedway, I have no idea how that's pronounced. Regardless, we're doing some dirt street stock racing. I've been practicing at this track a little bit the last few days. I feel like I'm getting alright with it. So we are going to see how we do in this race. I mean, obviously not too good since we qualified near the back of the pe back of the field. But still, I, I was like right in the middle in all the practice sessions in terms of lap time, so we'll see how this goes. Turn the sound up a little bit. Hear that rumble. Green flag. We're stuck on the outside line. There's going to be a lot of chaos on this first lap. Everyone trying to find their line and trying to get clear of each other. I like the lower line a lot, but when you take the low line, that happens. People get out of control, get loose, spin to the bottom, and then block the track. fifth but not for long because this guy on the inside of us has a good run and us not so much we're stuck on the outside that's not exactly where we want to be but he's able to clear us so we can get back down to the inside where we want to be back in sixth still two spots better than where we qualified Our goal is a top five for this one, so just need to get one more spot. And these guys up here, I don't know if they're going to last this entire race. It's number six and whoever's on the outside of him. Matt LeBlanc. Am I racing Joey from Friends? <laughs> Uh-oh. Car stopped up high. Where? Oh, not anymore. It's number six I do not trust. Oh. Those other two cars get into each other. And we have a run, but we're going to back off so we don't get into these guys. Oh, there it is. I saw that coming from a mile away. And we're able to get past it into fourth. So we've reached our goal. We just need to stay in this position for the rest of the race. We can afford to lose one more spot and we'll come away with the top five. And now that there's not as much traffic, we can kind of get the groove going that we want a little bit more. Car stopped. Where? Oh, hopefully this guy's going to take me out. And he almost just did. I had to go way high in that turn to avoid it. Now... There's a car behind me that's catching up. Fifth place car. Stupid microphone keeps moving. There's we're ten laps in. Third of the way done. I'm trying to make these laps a little bit faster than the last. So I apologize for being a little silent. I'm not a great racer, so it takes a lot of concentration just to do a lap by myself without crashing, let alone having a bunch of other people around me as we take that turn horribly there. Able to recover, though. Didn't get a good slide in that one, so we lost a little bit of speed. Over 
too much slide in that one, but I'm able to recover. We got the fifth and sixth place car behind us starting to catch up, so we're gonna wanna get going a little faster if possible without wrecking. Alright, we're halfway done now. Alright, we didn't take that turn good. Now this fifth place car is coming up on us. And we took that turn horribly. I did not mean to take it that low. And then this guy's going to pull a slide job on us, most likely. And this guy's got to run. He's got the inside. Just hold your line and I'll hold mine. And now here comes the sixth place car. He's gonna pull a slide job on us because we took that turn horribly. Inadvertently blocked him. I did not mean to slide up in front of him, but that's dirt track racing. Shoot. I'll just hit that inside wall, but the car doesn't seem any worse for the wear. So right now we're battling for the top five finishing position. Eight laps to go. Oh, we got a big slide there. Didn't mean to do that. I just lost grip. Although I'm not trying to be as aggressive as it may seem, I'm definitely not just going to give this guy this position. Well, we might have to here since he's got the inside, but we got a lap car up here. Maybe we can use this lap car as a peg to try to get back around him. That yeah, doesn't look like it. We just took that turn horribly. Unless someone else wrecks, I don't think we're going to get our top five. Still finished two positions better than where we started. On a relatively clean and exciting race with a decent amount of passes. I'm still happy. For this being my first dirt street stock race in probably three or four months, as long as I can finish better than where I started, I'll be happy. Shoot. either four or three laps to go. I can't count right now. Two laps to go. As long as we don't get lapped. So we got uh, the leader coming up behind us, but it doesn't look like they'll pa be able to pass us, obviously, in the last two laps. By the way, I don't know how the audio levels are. I just took the same audio levels I had for my NR2003 settings and just transferred them over the iRacing screen. So I apologize if the audio is a little off, but I'm just going to go ahead and post this anyway because, I don't know, this wasn't a spectacularly exciting race by any means, but exciting for me. It was fun. It was clean. Just nearly got a top five. 
some good harder racing by Joey from Friends. Just, just made us miss out on the top five position, but still better than where we started. We're just gonna... Park, save the replay, and end this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoyed it. So go ahead and save this replay. Go check out my social media pages. I'm also on Twitch and Les Banalis if you want to help support this channel on Patreon. Please go do that. Thanks so much to Tommy Joyce, Ryan Fitzy, and Jay Barker for your support on there. Really appreciate it, guys. So that's some iRacing. Plenty more videos like this to come in the future. Thanks so much for watching again. Hope to see you guys next time. Peace.